Good morning. It's Friday the 14th of August and we're going to read together this morning from Psalm 46. God is our refuge and strength, always ready to help in times of trouble. So we will not fear when earthquakes come and the mountains crumble into the sea. Let the oceans roar and foam, let the mountains tremble as the waters surge. A river brings joy to the city of our gods. The sacred home of the Most High, God dwells in that city. It cannot be destroyed. From the very break of day, God will protect it. The nations are in chaos and their kingdoms crumble. God's voice thunders and the earth melts. The Lord of heaven's armies is here among us. The God of Israel is our fortress. Come, see the glorious works of the Lord. See how he brings destruction upon the world. He causes wars to end throughout the earth. He breaks bows and snaps the spears. He burns the shields with fire. Be still and know that I am God. I will be honoured by every nation. I will be honoured throughout the world. The Lord of heaven's armies is here among us. The God of Israel is our fortress. Amen. Another psalm, a great psalm, um, a well-known psalm, particularly those first opening verses. God is our refuge and strength, always ready to help in times of trouble. That's an amazing verse. God is our refuge and strength. Not God was or God will be, but God is. That's present now and ongoing. Always ready to help in times of trouble. Not sometimes, not if he feels like it, not if it's just, you know, a whim, but always ready to help in times of trouble. And so the psalmist says, we'll not fear when different things happen. You know, it doesn't matter what happens in the world around us. We have God. Just pause and think about that for a minute. It doesn't matter what happens around you. We have God. What an amazing assurance. What an amazing faith to say that no matter what else happens, doesn't matter. We have God. But that's the truth. It doesn't matter what happens around us. We have God. We just need to trust him and know that he holds us close. Let's pray. Father, we worry about so many things. We worry about what will happen tomorrow. We worry about what will happen today. We worry about what happened yesterday and what might happen in the future. But Lord, in all of that, we thank you that there's something that we never have to worry about. We never have to worry about your presence with us, your love poured out upon us, your arms around us. Lord, these are things which are always there for us because you are always with us. Father, you say in your word, I will never leave you or forsake you. And we trust that. We trust your word. Lord, Lord, no matter what happens around us, help us to keep our eyes firmly fixed upon you and know that you are constantly surrounding us with love, peace and protection. Father, thank you. And help us this day, we pray, in Christ's name. Amen. Thanks, folks, for joining with me. It's Friday again, so there's no, there's no um, video for tomorrow morning. Um, Sunday morning, there'll be the normal video um, from church. One of the elders will lead it off, and then we'll link into the moderator's video um, while I continue to be off. And then these recordings will be back up again on Monday morning as we continue through the Psalms. So take care, God bless, and may you have a peaceful weekend. Bye.